Some final thoughts now. The bipartisan effort to short circuit the United States Constitution. Genius lawmakers from both sides of the aisle are working together to undo what the framers of the Constitution worked so hard to establish. Constitutional checks and balances. These historical ignoramuses are proffering legislation that would purportedly end any future government shutdowns. This misguided piece of legislation would do so by automatically funding government even if there is a budgetary impasse like we just experienced. Now, to the malinformed, this sounds great, wonderful. Yes, keep government running no matter what. To those of us who understand the Constitution, this would be suicide by legislative malpractice. It's not about a government shutdown. It's about the constitutional duty of the President of the United States to say, hey, Congress, go back and do your job. In this case, secure the border. But this is a constitutional two-way street. It's also about the duty of Congress to say to the chief executive, hey, Mr. President, we need you to sign off on this new budget. In the case of the 1995 shutdown, it was a balanced budget. And speaking of that, this unconstitutional legislation would then kill any hope of a balanced budget in the future. Why? Because it would bypass the current constitutional system and would automatically fund government at current levels. It would effectively put this republic's budgeting process on autopilot and set us on a course toward red ink oblivion. Yes, this bipartisan effort to avoid any future government shutdowns in reality is a thinly disguised effort to further erode our precious Constitution. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One American News on YouTube. And call your cable provider and kindly demand that One American News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.